So this is the caterpillar which is uh, eating up the ajola I'm not. I'll show you in your hand. Pick it up. See, it acts like it's dead when you hold by hand. But when you leave in the water again, it will start moving. Very cunning. Insects defense mechanism, but yeah, we have to get rid of this. Otherwise, uh, this is the moth which lays the egg it's, it's dead after laying the egg so this is the moth lying and see here is another one here so this is a very bad insect paste of ajola when we grow ajola so see here another one. See this? It will also act like they come this. So the best way to control is uh, we give fumigation with uh, uh, we 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 make cow dung cakes mixed with neem leaves and some bitter leaves then dry it dry the cakes and burn it and in the evening uh, we give a fumigation smoke it with uh, that thing so it repels the moth which comes mostly in the evening and yeah we, and we can in between that we can also spray some uh, bio pesticides made of herbal extracts which are found in the farm so we do that but the best way to control is through the smoke of a dried cow dung cake mixed with neem leaves and other bitter leaves this is very dangerous it will make the ajola like this see this this is eaten up and made into this color of so we feed it to the cows and when this is destroyed by the insects, you cannot feed it to the cows. And this tank, they are sufficient to just destroy the whole ajola in one day. These are very dangerous insects. So hand picking is also one solution, we can just, the way I am doing now, we can pick it up with the hands.